So this plant box is over three years old and the chili plants in here are also just as old. They have been overwintered. Uh, if you don't know what overwintering is, click this comment of this video. The point of this video is to show you that I've had chili plants in this box for over three years, producing me chilies. Okay. Yes, the initial cost of setting up a garden is quite a lot. It can be very expensive. But over time, it starts paying itself back. This plant box has paid itself back long ago already. The green ones over here, still alive. So it's going to be producing me chilies now for a fourth year. Now that I have my plant box and I have soil in the plant box and it's still at a good level, right? I have 30 centimeters of planting depth here. That's what you want. I now just had to go to a nursery. This chili plant, the small one, cost me three rand. And all I need to do is take out the old plant. Here where the chili plant was, the old one. I'm taking some uh, new compost that is still rich in nutrients. The soil in this box is not bad at all. Like I could plant this chili plant in here already. But just to give it a nice start, I put in two handfuls of the new soil. And there, there's it planted. And this will give me chilies for another three years. I'm just cutting off all the dead branches. After a couple of weeks, you'll see that new branches will form. I want to show you what it looks like. It's dark. It's holding moisture. But it's not like soggy or anything. And that's because, you know, I, I take care of my soil. As the soil feeds me through the plants, I feed the soil as well. Now I'll take all the dead plant material that I got from my chili plant box, like this old chili plant. I'll break it up a bit. I'll put it into my worm farm. My worms will eat on this and then the worms will produce me some leachate, which I'll put into my watering can. And then I'll use this to feed my plants.